Hey guys, my name is Matimio, and today I am running around with the uh, the crossbow. As many of you guys may know by now, I love the crossbow in Battlefield 3. There is just something about it that clicks with me. I always run it with my recon class because I love it so much. It's just extremely satisfying to get kills with it. And so for today, I just decided, hey, I'm going to run around it with this as a primary and then somehow manage to go on some ridiculous kill streaks that I probably didn't have any right to go on, but man, was it a blast. Uh, so that's going to be going on in the background, but I also wanted to give some advice and some tips on how to use this appropriately because Every once in a while, I do get questions asking me, Hey Matimio, I've used this weapon for a couple hours now, I get a kill here and there, but I just don't feel very comfortable with it. So is there any advice that you would recommend for a player like me? And so my first piece of advice is to know that this is a hit and run weapon. If you get into a room, you see multiple targets, take the shot and then just get the hell out of there. Hopefully you got the kill, but if not, just, just run away. The crossbow has one of the longest reload times out of any weapon in Battlefield 3. It's not as long as the light machine guns granted, but it's gonna take you a really long time. So if you go into a room, let's say there's two targets, you take out the first one, and then you you kind of hide in the corner for a second to go through the animation, that is gonna give the, uh, the other person plenty of time to realize that his buddy just died. He'll kind of look around, he'll see you in the corner with some weird grin on your face as you go through the reload animation, and then pump your body full of virtual bullets. And that is, that's something you're not gonna want. And so what you see in today's video is I am constantly going with the hit and runs. I will peek around the corner real fast, take the shot, and then run away. I am constantly doing that. And in reality, what you should probably be doing is switching on over to your primary or your secondary and using the crossbow as just kind of a backup, but sometimes you, 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 you know, you can't do that. Your primary or your secondary is out of ammunition, and so you do need to use the crossbow. But in reality, once again, you should probably switch on back on over to your primary and reload that instead of going through the long reload animation of your crossbow. But once again, you just need to realize that this is a hit and run weapon and you're not going to be able to go full Rambo with it. Uh, so for my next piece of advice is to understand that this has a very slow projectile speed. It is going to take the arrow a considerable amount of time before it reaches its destination and to to line up those shots at medium range and to get used to the bullet travel speed can be quite tricky. And so the way that I went about it and the way that I learned it is to, I joined Team Death Matches. I joined uh, close the close quarter DLC maps and I pretty much just went for people at a medium distance. And while I missed nine out of 10 times because it is so challenging, I started to watch how the arrow flew through the air. I watched where it landed and my brain started to make connections. It started to get the feel of how the arrow flew and then I started to nail those those medium range shots. I didn't really go for anything at really long range. You're just not going to be able to do that with the standard bolt. Uh, but you you do start to get accustomed. Like anything in life, the more you practice, the better and better you're going to get at it. And that's the same thing for the crossbow. And then when you do start to land these shots, the warm and fuzzy feeling you feel all up and down your body is awesome. Those shots are, they require a lot of luck and a lot of skill because if the target does move or if they stop midway through the flight of the arrow, you're gonna miss. But man, when you land them, that is that is the reason why I love using the crossbow because it's just so, so satisfying. Uh, but for my final tip, and this may sound a little corny and cheesy, but just have fun with it. The crossbow is meant to be a fun weapon, but when you try to learn and you try to get better with it, you are going to have some frustrating moments. I know I did, and when you get into that mode where you're just furious, you can't seem to make anything line up, uh, just put it away. Put it down for a while, come back later, because when you're frustrated, you're gonna make dumb mistakes, your gameplay isn't going to improve, and you're only gonna get even more frustrated. Uh, but yeah, guys, that is about it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed the fun kill streaks in the background, and hopefully these uh, tips will be useful for you. Uh, but until tomorrow, guys, have a good one, and take it easy.